potential, potential and, and kinetic, kinetic energy. energy. What's your favorite ride in amusement park? Is it Drop Zone, Top Gun, The Revolution? Well, did you know that all these rides are great examples of the law of conservation of energy? Huh? That's right. The law states that energy is neither created nor destroyed. It just changes form. When we're talking about roller coasters, there are basically two types of energy. Potential, stored energy, and kinetic, speed energy. For example, when the roller coaster gets pulled to the top of the hill, it has what's called stored potential energy because gravity is going to speed it up once it starts down the hill. When a roller coaster is gaining speed going down the hill, it is converting some of its stored potential energy into kinetic energy. Kinetic energy is the energy an object has due to its motion. Any object that is moving has kinetic energy. The kinetic energy of an object depends on both its mass and speed. For example, you roll both a golf ball and a bowling ball down a bowling lane at the same speed. Which will have more kinetic energy? Um, the bowling ball? Right. If you're to roll two bowling balls, one fast and one slow, which will have more kinetic energy? Um, the faster bowling ball? Correct. The formula for kinetic energy is one half mass times the speed squared. Potential energy is the stored energy that results from the position or shape of an object. The two types of potential energy are gravitational potential energy and elastic potential energy. Gravitational potential energy is potential energy related to an object's height above the ground. The formula for gravitational potential energy is the object's weight times its height above the ground. So the higher something is above the ground, the more stored potential energy it has. Elastic potential energy is the potential energy when it is stretched or squeezed. For example, you pull back on an arrow, changing the shape of the bow to launch the arrow. The bow has potential energy which can be used to launch the arrow, giving it kinetic energy. Another example is shooting a rubber band. Kinetic energy can also be turned back into potential energy. For example, when a roller coaster goes up a loop, it starts to lose its speed. This is because it is converting some of its kinetic energy back into potential energy. So the next time you're riding a roller coaster, remember that if it wasn't for the law of conservation of energy, you wouldn't be having so much fun. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the main event. Get ready to rumble! for this.